Hey everyone and welcome back to the Kevnalysis YouTube channel. Now whether you're a tech enthusiast, a DIY guru or simply just someone looking for a good time, we've got a treat for you today because I'll be doing a review of the Ring Doorbell 2nd Generation, a smart home security device system that combines a video camera, a motion sensor and two-way audio allowing you to interact with visitors at your doorstep and monitor them simply with just the Ring app. Firstly, let's take a look at the box. We've got the classic Ring branding, a few key features highlighted right here on the front, Inside the box, we've got the ring doorbell itself, a USB charging cable, mounting bracket, installation tools, and an instruction booklet. The ring doorbell is relatively larger than other smart doorbells in the market. It's approximately the size of a mobile phone, but with double the thickness. The upper part of the device is made of a reflective black plastic, which houses the 1080p camera and motion sensor. The lower part of the doorbell is a metallic material which comes in a range of colours. This one's a standard satin nickel. The doorbell has a large button at the front which lights up when motion is detected. Installing the doorbell took approximately 15 minutes. I decided to mount mine on the mortar so that it's easy to patch up in future if I decide to return the product or upgrade to a different design. You'll need a drill and a drill bit which are not included in the packaging. Simply mark out the screw holes and drill into these using a maximum 6mm drill bit. Insert the wall anchors and make sure they align perfectly with the mounting plate and that it's straight. Then screw the plate onto the anchors. The doorbell simply clicks onto the mounting plate and for extra security there are two additional star base screws that lock your doorbell into the plate. This adds some extra security and prevents someone from removing it by hand. The Ring doorbell comes with theft protection, which means that even if it's stolen, Ring will replace the device for free subject to terms and conditions. The key ones are that you must submit the request within two weeks of the theft, you must provide proof of purchase and a police report. Also, you can only claim this once. Now lastly, due to its versatile design, the doorbell is made to withstand both very hot and cold weathers. So it doesn't really matter what climate you're from, but it's still generally advised to keep this away from direct sunlight. Now I've been using this doorbell for just over a month now and the experience has been great. In this section, we're going to be looking at the video quality, the motion detection, the battery and even the app itself. The doorbell has a 1080p HD camera at the front with a 180 degree viewing angle giving crystal clear images during the day. It uses a home 2.4 GHz band Wi-Fi to play the video on your smartphone via the Ring app. You can see here I get the entire view from my garage, side gate and driveway all the way to the street. The camera also has night vision which works quite well at a closer distance but you can see in the image isn't as clear when someone is further away. Video also contains a motion sensor which can be adjusted in sensitivity and delivers a notification straight to your smartphone with pretty much no delay when it detects an object. It contains some inbuilt smart features to exclude specific areas you don't want detected. It can even detect packages and even little animals. The two-way audio feature enables users to communicate with visitors through the doorbell, even when they are not at home. When motion is detected or someone rings the doorbell, a notification is delivered straight to the smartphone which you can respond to interact with a delivery person or to deter potential intruders. The audio on the doorbell is also quite loud, so if there really were an intruder, you can scream as loud as you want and it should scare them away. Now, in addition to linking the doorbell up with your smartphone, you can also link it up to home ecosystems. One of these things, which is a Google Home, or even an Amazon Alexa, 
And what it means is that you can give it voice commands straight from one of these devices. Moving on to the battery, if you're not hardwiring the doorbell, Ring states a battery life between 6 to 12 months. I've been using mine for just over a month and have used about 25% of the battery. The battery life really does depend on how much and how often the doorbell is recording, so it's going to vary for everyone. It charges easily via a micro USB cable. If battery anxiety is really an issue, you can hardwire the doorbell. Now let's take a quick look at the Ring app, which requires just a 15 minute quick account setup and login when you're using it for the first time. The phone app takes you straight into the dashboard which shows all Ring connected devices to your account. Tapping into the Ring camera takes you straight to a live view with a wide viewing experience. Tapping onto the microphone button enables you to communicate with someone at the door live. The sound will play through the doorbell speaker in real time. Hello, I'm home. Hello. Hello, can you please open the door? Sure. I'm home. Okay. Okay, thank you. The Ring Protect plan saves all activity including packages, motion detection, doorbell rings and live communication into the Ring Cloud for up to half a year. Users without the Protect plan will not have motion saved. Clicking on the settings icon of the dashboard brings up a set of user-friendly settings that's intuitive to use. Three key settings worth noting are Adjusting the motion sensitivity to adjust the rate of unwanted motion being detected and to save battery. Package sensitivity can also be adjusted with a subscription. Secondly, defining motion zones only to detect motion or packages in areas set by your app. Lastly, geofencing enables the device to snooze when it detects that you have arrived home. This can be really helpful with reducing unwanted alerts. The Ring doorbell requires an additional subscription for $4.95 a month to gain access to additional features. Some of these include limiting motion detection to only trigger when there is a person that's detected, more customizations via home and away modes that can enable and disable recording, a video history cloud storage for up to half a year of footage, video saving and sharing. Through research, I've noticed some common issues with the Ring doorbell which you may want to consider before buying. Wi-Fi. The doorbell connects to the home Wi-Fi system, so in bigger houses with excessive steel and concrete, you'd want to ensure you're using Wi-Fi extenders or have a modem with strong signal strength to ensure that the area you plan on installing the doorbell has good signal. To test this before buying, Test your phone Wi-Fi signal at the location you plan to install the doorbell. Remember to switch it to a 2.4 GHz band. Number 2. Battery For those like me who aren't hardwiring the doorbell, one thing to consider is the battery life. To prolong the battery life, make sure to play around with the battery settings to suit your needs inside the app. You can play around with how often the device takes a snapshot, time between detecting motion alerts, and how long the video records for when motion is detected. Installation. If you haven't got power tools, you will need some help from a handyman to install the device on your wall to ensure it's secure. Now for some final thoughts. The Ring Doorbell Gen 2 impresses with its blend of security features, a user-friendly design and a sturdy build. Installation through DIY ensures a secure and theft protection setup. The 1080p HD camera delivers clear day images with a wide field of view. Customizable motion detection and two-way audio enhance the experience. Night vision is also effective at close distances. Battery and hardwired power options cater to diverse preferences, with battery life varying. Integration with smart home ecosystems adds convenience. Considerations include the $4.95 per month subscription fee for additional features, visiting a store to experiencing it firsthand before buying, and Ring's theft protection and warranty policies add confidence. In conclusion, the Ring Doorbell Gen 2 is a reliable and user-friendly smart security choice Explore, decide wisely and stay secure.
That's all we've got for you today, everyone. If you found this video helpful, make sure to share it with a family or friend and like and subscribe and tap that bell icon for future videos. Thanks everyone.